find that shirt in the hallway? Yeah. Oh. Did you find that shirt in Bob uh, Vila's? Where did I find it? Bob Who's Vila's, Bob Vila? Bob Vila's warehouse. Who the is that? He's a, he's a manly man who does work on his house. Wait. Unlike me. You ever watch those HGTV shows? They're actually pretty good. Uh, yeah. Do you? No, not that really. That Tiny House Nation show is pretty intriguing. All right. Yeah. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Activity Time. What are we doing today? I picked up a bum off the street. Uh, I told him, hey, you want to be on a video? And he sees this as his meal for the day. So say your name, bum. I'm Jimmy the Bum. Yep. And uh, what we're going to do today is try all the different kinds of Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, uh, candy bars, so on and so on. Jimmy? You're a big fan of uh, Reese's and stuff. What's your relationship with Reese's like? Well, as I was growing up as a child, all they really had at the time that I could remember is uh, the standard Reese's peanut butter cup and Reese's pieces. And uh, I think after that, they came out with like, I want to say the Reese's sticks. And then after that, it just kind of expanded from there. And here we are with, this is probably just a fraction of what's really out there, but... This is all we can get a hold of at the time. Well, DJ, I'm just the bum that's trying it all. So yeah, I uh, I so I drove around the area, the small town region, and I went through dollar stores. I went through convenience stores. I went through department stores and gathered up as much as I could find, and with the Reese's name on it. And we're gonna try it all now, and we're gonna rank things. Uh, from F being the lowest to S being the special. So S, A, B, C, D, and F. Uh, and uh, yeah. So I highly doubt anything's going to be in the F category. But what do you think, Jimmy? I think you should have went with the burplish fish pills. Well, it's too late for that now. What do you think we're going to start with, Jimmy? Do you already know the answer? Yes. Uh, probably just the standard Reese's peanut butter cup. You are correct. So let's go and find it on this big pile of candy. So in front of me here, for those of you listening, we just got everything set up looking very presentable, very nice. Okay, so this is the original Reese's peanut butter cup. It was released November 15th, 1928, and it's milk chocolate and peanut butter filling. It's a nice little cup there. Jimmy opened it up. They come in nice little trays. Yeah. I mean, that's cool. Yeah, a little paper Whatever. tray with two so, little peanut butter cups. I'll pass one over. Sure. Kay. Thank you. So, uh, is there a good old nice little discard pile? Now you just throw it on the floor. Uh, yeah, so it comes with this nice mm. little uh, brown wax paper, a little thin piece of filmy paper. And in my experience eating these throughout my life... Every once in a while, you'll get a double wrapped one. Mm. Have you ever oh seen yeah. It? yeah, oh yeah, I've come across those too. That's good luck. Mm. Mm. Nothing beats a Reese's, just mm -hmm. a good old traditional. Now, these are 105 calories per cup. Mm. We're gonna go through a whole lot, baby, a whole lot. All right, so next up, we got the dark chocolate Reese's peanut butter cup. And this one was released in the early 2000s. I'll open this one as well. Yep. Now, by the end of this, we could be throwing up. There we go. Well, the only thing I've eaten today was three eggs, and I had a triple cheeseburger from McDonald's. Typical. Um, <laughs> I actually had the, the DJ special today. Me and my wife went to Fazoli's. Okay, there's a dark chocolate. Looks and some, like, and there are other ways you can eat these too. Like I used to stick my tongue through the middle and hollow it out. You ever do that? <laughs> no. You want to try it? But just, there's just no stick wrong your tongue way. Straight through there. Okay. Yeah. Why not? So this is the dark chocolate one. It's just slightly darker. Well, obviously, this one's too hard. Yeah, I was about to say dark chocolate's always harder. Mm -hmm. There you go. It just broke it all. Apart. Ah. That's right, you get to just. Oh, it. these are all breaking apart. Okay, so. Yeah. Eh. Now, are we ranking these as we go? Because we kind of missed out on the first one. Well, what would you say? I think the original Reese's 
is S tier. Absolutely. Yeah, the Couldn't original. Agree more. Yeah. So original Reese's S tier. Now, I'm gonna go with this one. Hmm. It doesn't mesh well with me. The dark chocolate and the peanut butter. It's not really. Yeah. I said nothing was gonna go below. What did we talk about? Nothing was gonna go below like a B. Because everything in Reese's this, is good. This actually, I'm gonna go with like a C. I'm not going to be all nice. This yeah. one tasted kind of like ass. As much as I do love dark chocolate, it the mix over, with the Reese's ain't good. Overpowered it completely. Yeah. Next up, we got the white Reese's. Now, these mm. were originally called white chocolate Reese's, but they just cut out the, the chocolate part and just now they're white Reese's. And these were released in early 2000s. And what we have here are the snack size ones. Because I couldn't find the original, like, two-pack. So, these have a little bit less calories. They're 80 calories a piece. Now, I'm going to show you the t- I'm going to show you that little tongue oh, yeah, trick I do go. here. There we go. You got to hit it from the back. All right. It's a lot. This All one's right. hard, too. I had to do it with the original. I feel like I almost need something to clean my palate. You got any water? Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. We're all out. I don't know. It's okay. Mm. Yeah. What do you think? I don't like white chocolate, so. So that was a given that you probably wouldn't like this one, but for. I was, f- yeah. Go ahead. No, I was hoping the Reese's would mm. win me over. For but. for me personally, I am a big fan of white chocolate, but again, this one just tastes kind of bland. Like I don't even really taste the peanut butter. It could be because we're just coming right off the dark chocolate one. Like I said, maybe a palate cleanser, but you had your water cut off or something. <laughs> but- I'll get some water <laughs> so you could you could calm down. Hey, grab two. Grab one for you, too. Yeah, I know. I'll sit here and do nothing for a minute. Right. Stone cold. Ah, oh, there's a piece of chocolate on the ground. Five-minute rule. All right. Next up, we've got the Reese's Peanut Butter Lovers. And Jimmy, if you could be so kind to grab that from the table here. Peanut Butter Lovers. Let's see. Yeah, it's uh, one of the king size ones up there. I got it right here. And now about these, the Peanut Butter Lovers and the Chocolate Lovers. I'm just going to go in. Uh, yeah, and they're, um, they are uh, discontinued. So you could sell these on eBay now for like 12 bucks. But uh, I bought these last year when they were available for a limited time, summer 2019. And we're about a month away from expiration. So yeah, I we're saw still the, in. We're still in. Saw the expiration February 2020. And this is when we're doing this. So Okay, so peanut butter lovers. Now, I don't think we can handle smashing this whole pack, but... I think I can handle a full cup. Yeah, we'll just get one cup here. Okay. I've never tried these. I looked high and low trying to find these last year, and I saw these in a gas station on Chance, and I was like, there you are. I got you now. Got you. Okay, okay so here's the peanut butter lovers. Oh, this looks cool. It's got a uh, top peanut butter top here, and I, I'm curious. I never tried these, so I don't know. Okay, so you open it up, and I take the paper off. and it Smells like peanut butter. It's just peanut butter on the top, and it's Uh-oh. chocolate on the bottom. Uh, uh, Uh-oh. Yeah. They had one job. <clears throat> so let's see what this tastes like here. Oh, so about these peanut butter lovers, very thin chocolate all around, and peanut butter, you know, all around and on the top. So it's basically hardly any chocolate in it this one's sticky yeah it's like eating peanut butter out of the jar mm. well hmm. it's not bad though but mm. what would you rate the white chocolate did we do that one i think i'm gonna go ahead and give that one another c yeah because it wasn't terrible but it just wasn't good i'd, I'd give that a d actually. yeah because I do like white chocolate, but you don't, so I understand. Yeah. Now, what would you give this one, the Reese's Peanut Butter Lovers? Now, this one, it's it's good. It's definitely peanut buttery. It is what it says it is. Um, 
I'm going to go with an A because it's not like blowing me out of the water here, but it just, it, it has a great taste. It's just really, I don't know, something about it. Like I said, it's, it's more like literally taking a spoonful of peanut butter yeah. out of the jar. So, but yeah, it's solid A, I yeah, would that's, say. I, I'm getting that too. Cause when you look at the top of it, you can see almost little grains in it. Like it's actual peanuts grounded into it. And uh, I could taste that too, so I give it an A too. So it's A tier. Okay. Now let's move on to the chocolate lovers version. So there's two versions, and this one was also released summer of 2019, like I said before, for a limited time, and it's now discontinued. And this one has a lot more chocolate to it, obviously, and a thinner peanut butter filling on the inside. If they're as good as I remember them, uh, this this is gonna be S tier for me, but we'll we'll see. Here we go. Okay. Oh, and the peanut butter lovers is 105 calories per cup, and this is 100 calories per cup. Now, how much if we were to eat all of these, everything on this table? Do we have that information? I didn't add it up. I'll do that after the fact, though. Hmm. You know, there's a lot more peanut butter in here than you would think, though, for it being a chocolate lover's, but it's pretty good. The chocolate's pretty solid. Mm -hmm. Like, I say solid as in it's literally, like, harder. Yeah, on the top. Mm -hmm. I would give that one a B. Okay. It's just, it's, just, you know, it's almost like eating, like, like it is, it's chocolate lover's, it's uh, more chocolate than anything. Yeah. I couldn't even really taste the peanut butter in that one. Yeah, I it think, was there, but I couldn't taste it. Yeah, I remember back then it tasting a whole lot better, but maybe I was really hungry at the time. It's it doesn't taste like I remember either. So what do you give it? I give it a B too. So that's B okay. tier. Peanut butter lovers wins overall, and we are moving on. And so this is Reese's peanut butter cups stuffed with pieces. Wait. Let's see if we can get a... Jimmy bit into... Uh-oh. I haven't hit any pieces yet, and I'm halfway yeah. through. What a crock. What a crock. So these were released in 2016, and they are 105 calories per cup. Okay, I tasted one piece. Yeah, just one. I think that's all I've gotten. Oh, there's one in there. There's one more. Um, next up, or what would you give these? I would give these an A. They oh. taste exactly like a regular Reese's peanut butter cup, but due to the fact that they don't really, they lack Reese's pieces. Yeah. So. Taste wise, excellent, but just the fact that you're thinking you're gonna get like a mouthful of Reese's pieces within your peanut butter cup, it's not exactly correct. So Yeah, I only had three. I might have had two or three myself, but I didn't even taste them. In so a whole yeah. And moving on, we have the Reese's Big Cup, just the original. We have three different kinds up there, but we're gonna do the original right now. And the Reese's Big Cup is twice as tall as a normal cup. To try to figure out the release date exactly, I couldn't. So I had to find reviews on Amazon, and the oldest review I saw from a Reese's Big Cup was in 2007. Go ahead. Are you oh, you're not going to try? No, do you want to split? Or no, you no. You eat the whole, okay. Yeah, we're going to eat the whole thing. At least been around since 2007. Yeah, this is a big... I can feel the weight in my hand. Oh, yeah. These these babies this are like... This is a meal. These babies are 200 calories. Jesus. What are we up to? Uh, we're up to... <laughs> we're up to at least... We'll figure something we're, out, We're yeah. getting close to 1,000 here. Mm. So the chocolate all around is pretty thin. Look at all that peanut butter, though. Mm. I'm just going to say straight up right now, this is an S. Yeah. 
so mm. far, just the standard Reese's peanut butter cups, big or small, are always the way to go. And that's so far. Yeah. I would think so. They're always trying to top something that you can't really top. Mm-hmm. Okay. Look so at yeah. this pile already. This is uh, insane. All right. So we're moving on now to the Reese's Big Cup with Pieces. And these were released in 2016. 200 calories per cup. I think I'm getting to the point to where it's just sampling. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You want me to get a knife? We'll cut one in half. Whatever you want. We could rip it in half. I don't care. Well, if we rip it in half, it's going to break in a part in a million pieces. So let me get a knife right quick. So yeah, like I said, these were released in 2016 alongside the original Reese's Cups with Pieces. There you go. So uh, yeah, it's a whole big deal. There we are with half. You can see okay. right there, a little side section. I actually got a piece of Reese's Pieces. Yeah. Well, there's a lot more in here, so you're able to... At least get some in Jack. Got a lot more in here already. I feel the crunch. Oh, yeah. Mmm. I'll give these an S. Yeah, these are pretty good. I like the crunch. I give these an S, too. Along with the big cup. Okay, let's move on to the Crunchy Big Cup. This one was released in 2017. Crunchy Cookie Big Cup. Yep, the uh, yeah, yeah, the Crunchy uh, Cookie Big Cup. And this one surprisingly has 10 calories less than the others, with 190 calories per cup. You take the liberties, Jimmy. You could cut that in half because uh, we're dying. Yeah. Don't worry. After this, it's all downhill. These are the big. Well, uh... mm, you still got one. <laughs> Inside the peanut butter, there's these little brown chocolate bits that are the cookie. Look like. I don't know. They look like little mice turds. Yeah, I was going to say that. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe for me it's just a little too crunchy. I'm not really a crunchy Reese's kind of guy myself. Yeah. Hmm. Mm. Mm. Still good, though. I mean, I'll give it an A. Yeah. I just don't, I just don't like the crunchiness, so. I'm with you on that, so I'd say A, too. Next up, we have the Dark Reese's Peanut Butter Cups Thins. And these are practically new, uh, released in 2019. And they are geared more towards people on a diet, but still want to have that Reese's Peanut Butter taste. And I'm still going to cut it in half. I'm going to have one by myself. And uh, so they come individually wrapped in this bag. That's how I got them. And... They seem smaller, too. They're not as wide as the original. Yeah. And one of these, rounding up, is 57 calories per cup. Okay, you take it out of the package. Ain't got the little wax paper on it. Oh, there's hardly any peanut butter in this. No. You're done with that? All right. Oh, yeah. That's oh. it. Ugh. I'm going to give that one a big, fat F. F. No thanks, yeah. What a waste. Mm. Oh. All right, next up, we've got the world's largest peanut butter cups. <laughs> it comes in a package like this. And the earliest I could find of these being released anywhere was in 2009. So there's two 8-ounce peanut butter cups, rounding it to one whole pound, and per cup is 1,120 calories. Well, I'll take one and you take one. All Let's right. just smash it. <laughs> so here we are. We're going to open it up here. It should come with a tray and stuff, too. Yeah, hang on. Oh, man. Yeah, there we go. So 
for the camera here and let's show it off. Let's let's see. Jesus, you just want me to cut cut one up real quick? Oh, there you go. It, yeah, let's cut it up. And it ain't these cups aren't in wax paper. They're in like little plastic trays. Mm. Oh, I ain't even gonna touch this. I just opened it up just for people to see. You want to try it? We got it. Okay, let's try a sliver. Uh, let me cut it in half just so we can see the inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, yeah, do that. Um, okay. And yeah, yeah, yeah. One serving of this is uh, one sixteenth. So you cut one of those in eighths, and yeah, I'm doing my math right. I think I passed math class. Okay, there's no reason for us to try this one, but look at that. Sh Mm hmm. Yeah, look at that. Doesn't that make that you? right there is the holy grail ribeye rib steak? Yeah, so you just want to leave these on display or do you want to get rid of them? Yeah, yeah, my I, I well. can put it back in. The no, pot. you can, you can, yeah, and put this one like that. Yeah, yeah, there's no reason for us to try those. I'm gonna give it an S just on principle. <laughs> yeah, that's an S. That's S tier right there, without even trying. Yeah, cause and we're already close to death. I yeah, feel. I'm I'm feeling my head rush already. I, I literally feel it in my veins. Mm. I feel it in my veins. Like I'm literally like, I don't know. I can't explain it, but I just feel like I'm in some stupor right now. And I'm I've just, never eaten this much chocolate in my life at once. I gotta least. take a deep breath. <laughs> Uh, all right. So what we got next is Reese's dipped pretzels, and oh, these, those must be healthy. Yeah, they're they pretzels. Got to. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. Maybe it'll make us feel better. Here, pass it over. Where's yeah, my you knife? Could, you could go ahead and open it up. Here's your knife, here, bud. I'll give a nice clean cut here. And let's see. So like I said, they're released in 2018, and there's 28 calories per pretzel. Reach in there and get you some candy. Yeah. I'll just grab one. Same. So these are tan with a chocolate drizzle over the top there. Mm. These might be the ticket. These are, uh, according to the package, they're bite-sized pretzels dipped in peanut butter candy and drizzled with milk chocolate. With milk chocolate. I don't taste any Reese's peanut butter. Okay, so here's my thing. The product is good, but as far as the, you know, signature Reese's peanut butter taste, it's just not present. Yeah. So, for that alone, it's getting a B, because it just tastes like a regular chocolate-covered pretzel to me. It's yeah, it's still a good snack. Don't get me wrong, and you can still taste the little peanuttiest to peanuttiest. Is that a word? That is a word now. Yeah. But uh, yeah, it ain't it ain't up to par with the Reese's name. I don't think. Moving on, we've got the Hershey's chocolate bar with Reese's pieces in it. Okay. Let's see if they've upped their game. This one's fairly new, isn't it? Yeah, this came out. Uh, when did this come they out? They got a few hybrids like that out there, I believe. Yeah. Released in 2018, one bar is 220 calories. So one of these was one big cup, pretty much. Right. Okay, yeah. Not well, not the biggest, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it has a... Uh, um, yeah, allergic reaction or something. It looks like me after I got stung by a bunch of hornets. Or me after I ate fish. Yeah. So, yeah, this is a chocolate bar, and there's a, a ton of Reese's pieces in it. So I'm just going to get one little piece here. All I need is a square. Yeah. You could pass me one. There yep. you go. All right. I already see these are oozing with pieces. Is It looks like there's peanuts in here, too. No, I don't think so. I think you're just seeing. Oh the... yeah, that's peanut. Yeah. Yeah, that's a peanut. See right there, there's a piece of peanut. Let me get a little closer here. You're right. Yeah. Those are peanuts. So these have peanuts and Reese's pieces in them. Okay. So I'm again gonna go ahead and say. Really, just tastes like a Hershey bar. Yeah. 
A crunchy one. I don't taste any Reese. Don't get scared now, Jimmy. Maybe they feel the way we feel. Maybe Probably. we're next. I'm ready to take a big nap right about I'm now. I'm ready to take a walk. Okay, so that one's going to be a C. Because if I wanted a crunchy Hershey bar, I'd just go get a Mr. Good bar. Yeah, yeah, I, so. I agree with you on that. It's not bad, but it's nothing I'd yeah. want to buy again. Okay, what, so, what do we got next? Just add that to the pile. Up next, we've got the Reese's Nut Rageous. It's a candy bar with a peanut butter center wrapped in peanuts and caramel and then covered in milk chocolate. Outrageous. No, nut rageous. I think, is it this one? Yeah, it's that one. Uh, let's see. This one was released in 1994, and in 2014, it was rebranded the Nut Bar outside of the U.S. And there's 240 calories per bar, but I feel we're just going to break this into a piece each and try oh. this. You can see oh. right there the caramel just... Ugh. Gluing this thing together. Ugh. It's like, it's like, uh, what's that remind you of? Like, uh, I don't know. It reminds me I'm of a thinking lot of, of like things. hot glue or oh, something. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, they could be a, uh, many things, but I'm going to go ahead and say like caulk or like old silicone, like from when you're like redoing your tub or something. Yeah. Could be that. Okay. I'm just going to give you a slither here. Yeah. Just give me a slither. That's okay. all I need. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh. Okay. You can see the inside here. You know, get a little anatomy of the outrageous or nut rage. This is, yeah, the nut rage. Nut rage. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. When you say this is comparable to uh, another type of candy bar that's out there, perhaps, in just looks. Like Maybe a like baby Ruth, baby Ruth, yeah, or baby, mm -hmm. yeah, baby Ruth. Now I remember as a kid getting a Nutrageous when it first came out, and I was really excited because I loved Reese's. So I thought, oh, this is another Reese's thing. I'm being very underwhelmed, which I feel right now about this. I'd say Nutrageous is a solid B. Don't fix what's not broken. So. Yeah. And it just doesn't blow me away. So just a C. Okay. That's all. All right. I'm not trying to be too harsh here. We got the Reese's Outrageous. I'll let you grab that one. I think it's right over there. Oh, that's a fast break. What else do we got here? There we are. No, oh, it was on my side. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well. Yeah, good going. All maybe right. Maybe I just didn't want to get up. I think so. <laughs> Uh, so the Reese's Outrageous, uh, it's the same as a Nutrageous, only with Reese's pieces, pieces instead of nuts. Okay. So it's a peanut butter center wrapped in caramel and Reese's pieces and coated in milk chocolate. This was released in 2018, and there are 130 calories per serving. Okay. And there's three servings in that because that's a king size. But uh, I don't even want a serving. I just want maybe a slightly bigger sliver than what you gave me of the nut rages. Yeah? Yeah, just slightly. Just a little tad okay. bit more. And it is very similar as far as the... Oh, it's got the caramel the stuck caramel. to it again. Oh, oh, oh buddy. God. I'm going to try not to make a mess here. Yeah. I'm it looks like hair. It's literally like a hot glue gun. Yeah, it is. Okay. I think I got it intact here. See, I mean, come on. Come on, guys. Yeah. There you go, DJ. Oh, thank you, sir. Yep. All right, so there's a little cross-section for you boys. I'm watching at home, boys and girls. All right, pop this in. I'll give it a B because it tastes a little more Reese's. It's better than a outrageous, yeah. so they did good on that one. Okay, so B for me too. Yeah, I can't really describe it much except what you just said. It's just Perfectly a lot of sugar. explained. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, next up, we've got the Reese's Take Five, and he was trying to run away from us earlier. Oh, you better catch him. 
The Take 5 bar has been out since 2004, but this version with Reese's peanut butter was released in summer 2019. And they're, these come in, these come in pieces. I think it's two to three. Uh, the regular size is two. The king size is three. Right. Yeah. And so there are 100 calories per piece. Okay, so let's get about 25 calories a piece from this one. I just break it in half, and I just, I'll just i take one half, you take I'll, the other. I'll still cut it. Okay. I mean, they come in pieces like this, so. Yeah. Did you want a whole one of these? No, I'll just take okay. half. Okay. Now we have pretzel, caramel, peanut butter, oh, yeah. chocolate, and what else? They're supposed to have peanuts in them, which they might. I don't think I have any from what I can see. I'm not really getting the peanut butter, but I'm definitely getting the pretzel and the crunch. Yeah. Hmm. It's okay. I, w I wouldn't say it's better than the original Take 5. Yeah. I'm going to give this a B. I agree. It's B tier. Yeah, B tier. All right, next up, we've got the Reese's Crispy Crunchy. And this one was really hard to find. I searched high and low to find one of these. So inside the Reese's Crispy Crunchy is a crispy peanut butter candy. It's like the inside of a Butterfinger mm. uh, with Reese's peanut butter, and then it's coated in peanuts and milk chocolate. This was released in 2006, and it's 140 calories per piece. And since that's a king size, Jimmy is cutting up and portioning out. This that's three pieces. This one's sloppy. It's just falling apart. It is? Yeah, so here. Uh, is that cool? Yeah, that's fine. That works. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This one's going to be dirty. This seems... It seems like the peanut butter crispiness on the inside is a lot less dense. It's more airy than the Butterfinger. Butterfinger's really solid, but I'll see after I taste this. Yeah, you're right about that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Ugh. Oh. Hmm. Mm. I don't know. I wouldn't buy this again. It's leaving a very bad taste in my mouth afterwards. D for me. Yeah, D definitely. It wasn't. It wasn't like awful. It was just like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> don't buy that one. Uh, it's like falling in the mud or something. You got any tongue scrapers? That's what I. <laughs> uh, that's what I'd compare this to: falling in the mud with your mouth open. Oh. Next up, we have the Reese sticks. Here, you you could have one. You could handle one Reese stick. I'm not eating the whole one. <laughs> oh God, they look like you uh, could have one. They look Here. like they look like glorified uh, little Debbie. Uh, <laughs> what do they call those? Yeah, peanut wafers or whatever. Yeah. I'm going to take a bite of one, but I'm not eating a whole one. Yeah. Nutty bars. That's what, yeah. Nutty bars. Nutty yeah. bars. Smell okay. like it, too. Yeah, they do. So. Tastes like it, too. The, yeah. So the Reese's sticks are uh, three wafer sticks with Reese's peanut butter in between, and it's coated with milk chocolate. And these were released in 1998, 110 calories per stick. Mm. Not bad. These taste better than Nutty Bars, though. I'll tell you that much. Oh, yeah. I mean, Nutty Bars are, what, $1.19 at your local Wonder Bread? Yeah, they're garbage. Not what would bad. you rate the Reese's Sticks, Jimmy? Mm, say a B. It doesn't blow me away, but they're good. Every once in a while, I find myself hankering for a Reese's Stick. I don't mind them. So I, I'd give them an A, actually. Myself. I think I'm definitely, I, I don't know what kind of diet I should go on after this, at least for the next <laughs> week, minimal or max or whatever, but something needs to happen after this. You need to take a look, good long look in the mirror and question, <sighs> what is life? What is life? I can tell you what is life is a Reese's fast break. 
Those are life. That's my personal go-to, so I'm going to be really biased, and I'm already going to tell you this is an S tier for me because it's my favorite candy bar. Yeah. Yeah, the uh, fast break is peanut butter filling with a layer of nougat underneath and then coated in milk chocolate. Very simple. Three ingredients. Uh, in Canada, the Reese's fast break is called the Hershey Sidekick, and for them... It's unfortunately discontinued in Canada. Mm. This was released in 2001, and there's 150 calories per serving. There you go. Thank you, thank you. Look at that. Yeah, there we go. Nice little king size. Fast break. Soft, smooth. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah, babe. I just like the, the texture of them, too. It just really makes my mouth feel good. Yeah, it's like a massage in your mouth. It's like Reese's peanut butter is just kneading your back, but mm. it's in your mouth, and it's like, oh, mm-hmm. yeah, okay. Mm. It's yeah, it's S tier. Absolutely. It's got the the peanut butter, perfect, chocolate, perfect, everything, perfect. Yeah. Yeah, definitely S tier. Next up, we got Reese's Pieces, and uh, there you go, Jimmy, you can... Open them up. Okay. Tell the I folks here. I will. Uh, they're circular pebbles of uh, harder peanut butter than regular Reese's peanut butter in the cups. And uh, they're covered in a candy shell. They look like M&M's. And they were released in 1977. And also featured in a, a movie. That's right. What was, that, what was that movie? That's right, Jimmy. <laughs> well, Reese's Pieces, they were featured in a... E.T. E.T. And a uh, fun little thing about that is that the director of E.T., Steven Spielberg, he actually wanted to use M&M's, but Mars, the people who make M&M's, turned it down the offer. And so Hershey spoke up and said, hey, we got uh, some Reese's Pieces. You want to use that? And Boom, Reese's Pieces became very, very popular after E.T. As they should. And a little sidebar here, this water is S-tier. I don't know if it's because of all the chocolate and peanut it's, butter. It's because of all the, yeah. <laughs> but this particular brand of water is also my favorite. So DJ here knows what's up. Ice Mountain, baby. He's, he's got the best water. Ice Thank Mountain. God you're not like one of those weird, yeah, Ice Mountain. That's yeah. it right there. There's only three color, or yeah, three colors of the Reese's pieces. You got brown, orange, and yellow, and they all taste the same. And Don't even start. The, yeah, here we go. <laughs> well, Reese's pieces. I just want to say there's 150 calories per 38 pieces, okay. so you could eat a bunch of those and still feel pretty okay. Yeah, they're light. Yeah. So I'll, I'll go ahead with the S tier. I mean, they're pretty good. <sighs> yeah, yeah, they, they're pretty. They're better than I remember. So I wouldn't go S, I'd go A. They're originally called PBs, but they're like, nah. Yeah. We're down to the last one here, and it is the Reese's Easter Eggs. And uh, yeah, they come in a nice little uh, spring yellow packaging with you some wanna flowers. You want to save one? Or? Yeah, I guess cut so. You I mean, cut that one in half, yeah. This is the final victory lap of uh, Reese's for final today. Final boss. <laughs> The final boss. <laughs> so we didn't even mess with the final boss's boss. No. I had the that's pause. the district manager right yeah. there, buddy. I had to plug in my game Jim, genie to beat that. Now let me tell you something, brothers and sisters. The eggs. Yeah, show that. Show the that eggs, to the camera. <laughs> the pumpkins. What else we got? The Christmas trees. Trees. Yeah, yeah. They pack the most peanut butter. Yeah. So we already know what we're ranking this. So, but let's let's just taste it first. I don't know how much you want. I'm just giving you a slither because I think just, we've had enough. Just yeah, just enough. Here you go. Uh, oh, first of all, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> that right there is the creme de la creme. It's just nothing but a block of peanut butter with a very thin, going all around piece of chocolate. Okay. Yes, very much. Man, that's that is moist. It's very moist. The 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 peanut butter is almost wet, man. The uh the mm. chocolate is just as I hold this, mm. it's just like dissolving 
into the peanut butter. It's very fluffy, moist, mm. and mm. good. Oh, God. Oh, my God. It's like a fast break without the nougat. If there was something higher than an S tier, that would be it. That's where the Easter eggs are. S tier, undeniably, that's where it needs to be, and that's what I'm sticking mm. with. One of the oldest side Reese's products than the pe- pe- peanut butter cups. I'm, so, I'm stuttering all this chocolate. I'm, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Uh, so, Jimmy, did you have fun today? I had fun. Um, there's a few things I'm taking away from this. Mm-hmm. It's either going to be a nap, a walk, and that's immediate uh, after effect, yeah. or a puke. Um, <laughs> <laughs> long-term effects of this we're not sure but i think i'm going on like a liquid vegetable <laughs> diet for like a week what about you i'm gonna sleep like a baby tonight yeah you gonna uh take care of yourself tomorrow or is it just another day in the life of dj glowing ice <laughs> no i'm just gonna i'll probably just have some eggs tomorrow triple and cheeseburgers and eggs no no just eggs tomorrow <laughs> You got a vein popping out of your forehead right now. I don't know if that's related or not. I don't know if... Uh, am yeah. I, do I have the V going down? Well, you got that too. I'm just looking at the side of your head. You got veins just popping. Oh, no. You should show the camera that. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh, I don't know either. But anyway, we're yeah, just you're sweating. We're, we're just you're, spitballing here you're about... Forehead. You look pale in your oh, sweat. My God. It's uh, bedtime anyway, so... Oh. A cup of coffee or something? Ah, uh, no, because if I put even a drop of sugary creamer in there, that's going to be literally the death of me. So I think I'm going to stick with water. Okay, guys, thank you for watching uh, this uh, activity. Thank you. Uh. Anyways, thanks, guys, for watching this edition of Activity Time. Thanks for listening. This was a good idea, bad idea. I don't know, but it was one hell of an experience. Jimmy, don't die. Not yet. Please don't die. All right. Bye, guys.